Welcome to Creative Solutions. Today I will be teaching you how to reverse a number. Uh, it does not matter whether the number is three digit, four digit. Okay, let's create a class. Reverse. For the static void main, we do not. I do not want to type this. And for Java dot util, of course. If you do not know what I am writing, refer to my playlist here. Uh, we should pop up now and follow through and understand the scanner class why I am using a scanner class basically scanner class is used so that I do not need to take so that I can take user input uh, from the console itself this is how I we declare and uh, I have explained in a data types in video where I have explained how to declare as these variables in scanner you can refer that video to understand now let's start I uh, will make a copy of this number so that we can check it out later uh, the reverse and the original one ok int div equals to 0 let's start we will be using while loop because we do not know how much iterations we have to do here while n1 not equals to 0 because we will n1 can be 3 digit or 4 digit number we do not know exactly how many digits the n1 is gonna be so first step is to find the remainder int remainder equals to n1 mod 10 equal to ok this way now we need to calculate the reverse reverse is basically you need to do for with remainder plus reverse into 10 see what happens like if I'm giving a number let's uh, just put comment I'm putting a number as 1 2 3 now the first remainder which will when we divide with 10 we have a remainder is 3 now what will happen in the rev folder rev uh, what will happen 3 plus Actually, the default value for rep I have installed at 0 uh, into 0 into 10. Okay, this is what will happen. So, it will be basically it will come down to 3 only. Next time when I am doing this, I have okay, next time, okay, next time, okay, for next step, I'll do one more thing. I'll just divide the number by 10 so that next portion can be. Calculated from the remainder the other way around. Okay, now next, what do we need here? First of all, rev equals to now remainder. What we have here is 2, 2 plus 3 into 10. Why I'm writing 3? Because 3 is equals to rev, which has been stored earlier. So this will give you 33, I mean 32. Okay, now last step, we have 1 rev is equals to 1 plus 32 into 10 so basically we come down to 321 so that's it we have 123 reverse at 321 okay we will print out the original as well as the result here first of all let's print out the number okay okay let's do this that's it and now we'll run this program i'll just click save i'll come here run as java application okay, enter a number let's enter 145 see we have a 145 converted to 541 let's go for a four digit number uh, one two three four see it's working fine okay we'll go for some zeros because you might be confused whether we can use zeros or not okay 1007 see it's converting 1007 to 7001 that's it for this video please refer to the entire playlist of java to understand basic concepts and there are different programs and all where i'm also telling you how to install java programs everything thank you please do not forget to subscribe to my channel for any further videos which i'll be making 
Take care. Have a nice day.